Welcome, everybody. I was taken off and had to turn back there so I could uh, get a view of the American flag blowing in the wind. Uh, kind of a nice sight to see. I was talking to Keith, a co-worker of mine, and he said they were doing a dredging project in Mondovi, Wisconsin. So I grabbed the drone and I thought uh, it might be kind of fun to get a little video. We can look back and see what the lake looked like when it was uh, drained. And uh, this is Mirror Lake that we're looking at. Uh, that's the exit right below there where the water goes out. And we have March 13th of 2020. 42 degrees out and uh, very windy. But we aren't going to let that stop us. Most of the snow is gone, but we could still get a snowstorm before we're out of the woods. We're going to start flying at about 120 to 150 feet and then we'll go up as necessary. Uh, if we look down below in the lake bed we can see a bunch of fish cribs down there. That's the square looking things. And when the water level is up to normal the uh, fish cribs are covered. Kind of provides a little shelter for the fish. Looks like we have a nice little park on the left hand side. Mondovi is a nice town. I've uh, flown through Mondovi before and I remember uh, driving through and it doesn't take you long to drive through but when you see it from the air it's actually a lot bigger. Uh, very nice little town. Uh, just has that nice hometown feeling. I think last time I was here I actually flew over this lake, Mirror Lake. And so now we're going to get a chance to see what it looks like uh, when it is uh, drained. Looks like it's uh, fed by two different areas here. Uh, one in the upper left hand side. And then as we swing around, we're going to see in the right-hand side another entrance coming in. And now we're going to swing around the corner. And we're going to have to go up a little bit. We're going to go up to about uh, 260 feet. I have a pair of gloves with me uh, and unfortunately I didn't put them on before I took off so my hands are starting to freeze now. It's not that cold but with the wind blowing and then holding on to the plastic controller uh, that seems to take the heat right out of your hands. This is kind of interesting right here in this area here. We can see a little more snow there that's kind of trying to hang on. And I'm kind of getting to the point here uh, where I think Maybe turning around is a good thing to do. So we'll swing her around there. Hold on to your chair.
And now I'm going to throw it in reverse and do a little backing up. Now we're getting uh, some reflection from the sun there in the water. And now we can see one of the entrances where the water are coming in, where the water is coming in. And now we'll start heading back. It's really amazing the video is as uh, stable as it is uh, with the wind blowing. The uh, drone there actually moves around quite a bit but the video stays pretty rock solid this is one of those days where you really have to monitor monitor your uh, battery level uh, flying against the wind there uh, takes a little bit more power and so you have to kind of factor that in as you're flying around And here's another entrance right here. And on the right hand side there, uh, towards the top of the screen there, we have a dock. Looks like some place you can go and fish off of. Now we're going to come down in elevation. And I believe I'm about a hundred feet right here. Maybe a little bit higher. And there's that dock there. And here's where the water exits the lake. I guess it's marked dam there. And we can see across the road there where it discharges.
We've had a pretty easy year so far. There hasn't been any major flooding around from snow melt. It's actually been a very good winter. Not overly cold. After last winter, I think uh, we set some record a record for snow. And we're going to go a little lower yet. Unfortunately, the uh, lighting isn't quite cooperating here. We have the sun kind of lower in the sky. And there we have one of the smaller fish crib there. My intention was to go a little bit lower, but uh, as windy as it was, I decided uh, that's about as low as I was going to go. So we can see some of the fish cribs sitting on the other side over there. If it wouldn't have been as windy as it was, I would have probably gone, gone down a little further. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go up to uh, 396 feet. And kind of get a little look around. See what it looks like from uh, up in the air. Yeah, by now my fingers are getting a little bit numb, but that's okay, it's worth it. And we'll back up a little bit here. I'm kind of backing up and uh, positioning myself for landing a little bit, so... And that's kind of a overall look there. So now we'll kind of get ourselves uh, in line for a landing. There's a nice little walking path around here too, so on a nice day you could uh, put your walking shoes on and once this is filled with water, enjoy a little walk around Mirror Lake. And I think I'm just about where I need to be to start bringing this thing down. So 
So we got to look at the uh, dredging project in Mirror Lake in Mondovi, Wisconsin. Nice little town. Nice place to visit. So thanks for coming along and we'll catch you next time.